Hello wonderful family, another glorious day and another beautiful opportunity to share the word with you. Hallelujah. Praise God. Today I want us to study from the book of John chapter 16 and we'll be reading from the King James Version. Join me. Verse 23. And in that day, this is Jesus speaking now, and what day is he talking about? The day and age in which we live in presently. I'm speaking now in the year 2024 before the return of our Lord Jesus Christ. And in that day ye shall ask me nothing. Verily, verily, or truly, truly, I say unto you, or amen, amen, I say unto you, whatsoever. What does whatsoever mean? It means anything. Whatever. Whatsoever. It means exactly what it says. Whatever. You shall ask the Father in my name. He will give it you. Or he will give you. If you look at the italicized word there, which is it, it means it wasn't in the original. So you could read it without that included. Which means, like he's saying, I'm taking an oath before you. I say unto you, whatever you ask, you shall ask the Father in my name, he will give you. It's either Jesus meant what he said or he lied. He's not a liar. And it means that he meant what he said. So if you come to him like a child, taking what he has said as gospel, as truth, like he says, verily, verily, which is amen, or an oath, he's giving you an oath, he's giving you his word, that whatever he shall ask the Father in his name, the Father will give you. Then you can boldly come before the Father in and ask in his name, guaranteed based on the sure the more sure word of prophecy based on his word that the father will give it to you or will give you and you can leave that place of prayer convinced fully persuaded that you've got it because the father has guaranteed it in the, the words of his son he says verse 24 before now you have not asked anything in my name ask and you shall receive not you may receive you and you shall receive that is a guarantee and when you receive your joy will be full so the reason that you ask is for fullness of joy let me read that again hitherto have you asked nothing in my name ask and ye shall receive that your joy may be full so when you receive your joy will be full you 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 will explode with with joy and you will move to testify i read the whole thing again and in that day i said again that day is this day. Ye shall ask me nothing. Let me paraphrase it here now. I swear to you, whatever you ask, you shall ask the Father in my name. He will give you. Period. Don't let anybody hoodwink you. That is Jesus' word for you. Whatever you ask in my name, the Father will give you. So go to the Father and ask the Father. Putting confidence in this word, having faith in this word, that when you ask, because there is a guarantee that he will give you, you live there telling him thank you for having, for keeping your word, for your faithfulness to your word, to, to keep your word. And I count this as done that you've given me. I have received. This is before now you have not asked anything in my name. Ask and ye shall receive. The Father will give you, you will receive, and then your joy will be full. So live there with fullness of joy that it is done it is done praise god praise god hallelujah 